Hi and welcome to this Garden Gnome Software screencast. This screencast is a continuation from our Google Street View export video and the purpose of this video is to show you what happens to your um, panoramas once they've been uploaded to the Google server for a few hours. So with that said I'm going to open up Pano2BR and as soon as I open up you'll see that it starts to log in to the Google account, there it goes and if you didn't want it to log in automatically just click the revoke access button here and then you would need to log in again uh, next time you opened up Pano2VR but if you don't click that it will log in by itself on open. Now from the welcome screen I'm going to select the uh, Google export which is the project we were working on and as soon as I click that, click that it loads up the project. There you go. Right okay so with that done um, if you'd have closed the window accidentally you can still go file uh, recent files and opened it that way okay cool right so this is the project um, when we uploaded last time uh, in the Street View browser all of our in, uh, images were individually listed but now Google's had them for a while it knows that it's a, it's a single tour so now you see it's added them under one grouping, there we go, so if I expand that we can see all the individual images so it's one group and it's a 10 node or 10 image tour our terminology is that we class each input images as a node so this is a 10 node tour and you can see here that we've got the green connection icon and that's telling me that all the images that are stored locally on my computer are exactly the same as the images on the Google server okay cool, right, moving on, um, let's just close that all I want to do now is just check the tour online and the way we do that is just simply click this link here under the account that opens up um, the Google website I'm just gonna cursor to the first image there we go so there it is opened up so this is the first the first node you can see that there's the logo that we added under the edit master nodes so that logo will now appear at the bottom of every single panorama and you can also see that the uh, tripod that we patched out is also missing here so all I'm going to do now is just click a couple of the um, hotspots just to make sure that it's all linked and they're all working which they are and yeah there you go that's the Google Street View um, project uploaded onto Google and working as should as always thanks for watching